from 1974 or 3, probably 1973, on West Main Street in Houston, Texas, the Walking Talking Green Frog Lounge Blues Medicine Show and Morality Play. Originally, I think, called the Green Frog Lounge Walking Talking Blues Medicine Show and Morality Play. <laughs> I was smoking listening to Jerry Jeff Walker the other day. In walks this chick, she says she's from the SLA. Said she played drums with Joplin and Greg Allman too. She'd been electroshocked and mental warded ever since she was two. I took her in. I didn't know what to do. She looked way down and said she wanted to screw. Well, I didn't want to send her where she said she wanted to go. The Green Frog Lounge, just a block and a half down the street. Well, she had all these papers saying she was different people on different medications. Well, Lord, what could I do? Well, the next night I was riding my bike so fine down to the rich head to get some wine. I thought I'd show Sky a good old time with his spaced out brother. Calls from the corner and says, Hey man, you know of a place called the Green Frog Lounge? <laughs> when holy smoke, it's <laughs> coming at me again. <laughs> well, I was carrying a big bag of empty Coke bottles. <laughs> About 12 of the... 32 ounce size, I think. Well, I didn't know if I should turn around and help him out or not. But in these days of apathy, uh, I decided to turn my bike around. And as I did, bang, I fell down, smashed right upon the Coke bottles. And I'm lying in the middle of the road and I pull the blood. <laughs> Lots of glass on the street and a lot of blood on the glass. I cross over the street and I was going to tell him that it's two blocks away. And then I thought I'd just mention the chick from the SLA open the boy perhaps had a good sense of irony. But smash! This car runs over my bicycle. <laughs> well, I look in his eyes and they're real still and express no hereto before expressed form of human emotion. <laughs> so I left him on my total bicycle and went off to get some wine to replenish my system. Well, I thought I was the punchline of the Cosmic Joker's joke. I've been running into so many of those weirdy kind of folk. Well, not the kind that have long hair or smoke. But the kind of us that just don't seem to have any hope. You know who I mean. There's a little bit of it. And a little bit of that in all of us. <laughs> Let's make sure it don't get to you. I felt like I couldn't get away from all the games people do and don't play, so I smoked and I smoked and I dropped all the next day. And just when I was beginning to float, I ran into this nymphet named Quicksilver. As I was going to reclaim Jim Hibbard's immortal cosmic cowboy country western hat. <laughs> and since I knowed her, I... I since I knew her. <laughs> I knew something was going on when she asked me 
if I knew where she'd had a brew that afternoon. And I said, nope. And she said, oh, just around the corner at the Green Fellow Lounge. And I went, holy smoke! It's coming at me again! Look out! Well, we went back to the Citadel and the rest of the stores too, off the hotel. We sort of started doing this little dance and me and Texas Fur were put into a trance. Got in a fight over this little lumber. He wound up like Jesus in the rain. Knocked out, stretched down, senseless of pain. A veritable cross in the grass. me about the shadow or the fall or which comes first, the act or the wall. The message is to love your brother and that's all. Although it's pretty hard to do when you got them green frog lands blues.